did you think see energy wise after that initial burst? Yeah, we just didn't have it. Uh, but I thought it was self inflicted. I thought the second uh, group didn't come in with great energy and got a little frustrated because they did get good shots and they just didn't fall. Uh, so I thought that you know six minute stretch to begin the second quarter hurt us, and then I thought the first six minutes in the third quarter destroyed us. You know, and I thought those two stretches were the difference in the game. We took a lot of jump shots too. Yeah, not going to use fatigue as an excuse, but no. um, we won't use that. When you're tired, though, is it hard after if the first unit plays well, the second unit doesn't? Can it be hard to kind of regain that rhythm? Yeah, a bit? no, it shouldn't be. Listen, how many times have the first unit that played well and the second unit have come in and bailed them out? So it's that's why it's a team game. Uh, you know, it's funny. We just were searching for lineups tonight. You could see it. I actually came in the game thinking that might happen. You don't know. I was prepared for it. Uh, but we went, we had four guards on the floor. We were just searching for anything to give us energy. Uh, and it just felt like every time we got a chance, we cut it to seven or six, somebody would step up and make a three or we'd foul or turn the ball over. And so it was just one of those games we couldn't get out of a hole. And we were also playing a team, I thought, that was very confident against us. They beat us a week ago. And once we let them back in in that second quarter, you knew it was going to be a hard game the rest of the night. When you got within four toward the end, did, did you feel good about things, or did the game just had a bad feeling? Um, I don't know if I felt good about it, anything uh, tonight, honestly. I felt we had a chance to win the game, you know, when we cut it to four. And, you know, we, we just never got over the hump. We had three or four or five times during the game where, to me, we made runs, and then, uh, you know, they made a three. We turned it over. They got an offensive rebound. We fouled, like, two or three three-point shooters. So... <laughs> It's just one of those nights. You mentioned you were just looking for lineups tonight, but you did switch up the second unit, put West back in. Was there any particular reason? Yeah, I was just anything? looking for anything. Uh, I was looking for energy. What's the, what is the biggest difference though between when Paul? You mentioned before the game it was defensive decision. Yeah, there, I just like the, I like them both, and you know, um, West had a run, Paul's had a little run for us, and you know, they both will play. It's a long year. I'm not that concerned by that. Those two right now, I'm got to get the whole team going. I know you guys finished that road trip strong, but yeah. uh, I think you have lost four out of six now. Does it yeah. feel like a little bit of a funk right now? Not really. I just feel like we're losing individual games. You know, I don't um, feel like we're going to ever be in the funk with this team. I really don't. We may drop games here and there, but I think we're going to win a lot more than we lose. And um, this is a this is a good basketball team. Like I think a great team. And but we got to do that every night. And like I told our guys at halftime, we got to turn. Uh, we can't have bad nights. We got to have hard nights. And right now, we're having bad nights. You know, a hard night means that you didn't play well, but you figured out a way to win. A bad night means you didn't figure it out and you lost the game. And